This is your mind. <laughs> this is your mind blown. Hey guys, this is Malanda. Welcome back to Thimbleweed Park. We uh, we just opened up the, the gate, so now we're heading off to the factory. Open two. What's this? Huh? Did this ex explode? Is it like a bomb? What is this? It's it's locked and it's locked and there's no handle. Well, how about this? Nope. Hello, Tronics. Okay. I don't want to pick that. I can't open that. Oh, Nothing happens. Okay. Huh. When those security lights are all green, the door can be unlocked. Okay. I can't reach that. Wait, what? Why am I... One? When those security lights are all green, the door can be unlocked. Okay. Sure. What just happened? Fripping. Alright. Let's see. What is this? I don't want to pick that up. Okay, push it. Four! Oh, does this mean... Wait, is there like a three on the other side? Let's see. Does this mean that we we need like 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 four guys to press it at the same time or something? Yeah, there is a three. Okay, there is a. Oh oh hey, what is this? Nice photo. Looks like a kid I went to school with. This is probably filled with clues and puzzle solutions. <laughs> okay. Okay. Let's see. Pelotronics factory security is very important to us. The Pelotronics factory contains highly proprietary machine and technology. A breach of security is a breach to uh, a breach of each of us. When making the rounds, be sure to check in to each security box within 5 minutes of the last box. When the correct time is entered, the station light will turn green. If the factory AI is engaged, it's important to never enter the factory unless the SR01 have been disengaged. Pelotronics Inc. will not be responsible for any death or dismemberment that result in failure to shut down all factory AI before entering. Failing to check in at the proper times could result in a factory lockdown. If factory lockdown occurs, the D PF001 Master Tube may need to be reset. The CEO is the only one with the proper instruction for resetting the PF001 for security and time code information. Call 2339. Okay. Oh, time code information. Interesting. Interesting. Well, I thought we were just supposed to press it all at the same time. But now, how do I how do I change this thing? I can't I can't change it. Huh. I don't know. I don't want to do that. It would make it look red. I don't want to use it with that. Oh, Lurleen. You're so soft and fluffy. I don't think I should use this. It says it's dangerous. I don't want to play games with my starship now. I'm not wearing it. No. Well, let's see. What do you have? Okay, let's go in. Hey, hey, use this. It doesn't seem to fit that. I'm sure it has a very important use near the end of the game. Oh, jeez. Come on. Well, you don't have anything else useful. How much? You go in. You have a key. It won't fit there. <gasps> Wait, how about this? It's my father's old pocket watch. Really? Really? Okay. But what time am I supposed to turn it to? Oh! 
Not leaving Dad's watch behind. I get it. I, I get need it. to find the correct time to set. I get it. I get it. Correct time. For time code two three three nine, and you have a phone, so um. Thank you for calling the Pillowtronics Automated Security Information Line. For today, proper start time for Station 1 is 7.30. All right, 7.30. Station 1. Station 1. This is Station 2. So is it what? Oh, God, what is it? 7.30? All right. Let's do it. We can do it. Yes! Okay, that's one. Well, what? I might as well get all these guys, like, to chill out at the front door. Does it matter? Maybe not. Maybe... Maybe they'll just all gather? I don't know. Whatever. I'll just send you right here. And then you go to the second one. I have to do this within five minutes, right? Yeah. Let's do that. First. Okay, let's see. Go. Yep. This way. Three, three, three. Excuse me, Dolores. Please get that to kill. I'll send you to that side first. And then you can just head back. Alright. Yeah. green so now we can go in ha 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 have to get the clown there as well all right squeaky 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 squeak 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 all right i think the laura should press this button because push the doors moved a little but stopped they must be stuck they're now unlocked can we it opened just a little more they're now reset what I think they're unlocked. Can we go in? It opened a little more. Damn. Oh, hey, 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 let's try this. It opened a little more. Yes, I think it's it opened a yes, little more. Yes, 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 yes. Yes. I think someone could squeeze through now. Okay, you can open this now. Oh, wait, wait, no, 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 no. Okay. I think I can squeeze through the opening. Okay, fine. I think Go. I can squeeze through the opening now. Go. Holy! Oh, you said it, clown. This can't be. It's not possible. What have you done, Uncle Chuck? Okay, what happened? What? <laughs> Those look like bouncing wings. Shut up, Ransom. That's it? 
Damn it. So. Nothing is clickable. Can I look at these? No. Okay. Really? That's it? Touch it. Use it. What's with the speed running? Oh, hey, installing virus. Why? It's a foolproof electric. I don't want to pick that up. Oh, oh, what did I do? supposed to go downstairs I can't reach that that picture looks familiar kind of like Thimbleweed Park without any buildings it's a do I don't want to pick that where am I what is this what door is this huh oh okay anyway let's go back in I think it does anything hey journal Oh, hello, hat. Can I pick this up? Hey! All right, let's walk to the journal. That looks like Uncle Chuck's journal. Yeah, let's let's put this on. Cause pirate hats are awesome, and let's read this. Okay, let's. <laughs> well, let's read this. Entry three six six eight. It's true. A lot makes sense now. Where is the Dolores' mother? Interesting. Entry 5129. Been spending more and more time in the lab with the AI. In our text adventure, it's unlocking some interesting mysteries. My previous assumption about it. Uh, um, my previous assumptions about it and the world seems to be correct. Entry 5201. More research and falling deeper into this rabbit hole. Odd things. I never considered before we're making sense. Thimbleweed Park has 80 residents, but 3,000 people in the phone book. It didn't make sense until I considered the impossible. Entry 5201. Oh my god, this is terrifying. Entry 5202. The AI says, There is only one way, but I've started to suspect it. Is it telling me the truth? 5203. We are being watched. I am being watched. The AI is not what it says it is. 5205. I am now convinced the AI is not an AI at all, but something else. Something from a different world. The same world the people from the phone book are from. 5205. I've created a small Tron tube that lives deep in my text adventure, and it is uncoupled from us. It keeps counting up and up. We must be resetting. Hmm. 5205. I need to go deeper. The deeper I go, the less they can watch me. They aren't paying attention to what happens below. They are only watching at the surface. Fools. Franklin keeps trying to get the factory restarted to make some stuff animal. I can't let this happen. My world will be discovered. I need more power. Reverse radio transmission might do it. Franklin has been taken care of. I feel bad. If he was my real brother. Franklin called a foreign investor to come in and evaluate the factory for a possible investment. The AI says I need to stop this. I don't know if I can trust the AI. Maybe I can. Another. Okay, the numbers are getting weird now. So, see? Two. <laughs> 5201 and then 5202. And then there's a reset. See, now it just came. What? I have a plan to deal with. With the foreign investor, I'll set the gears in motion. I can't tell if everything is unraveling or coming together. Another reset. I can feel them now, even without the uncoupled, even without the uncoupled tube. The Pillotron machine is done. The text adventure is perfect. I don't think they notice I can hide there. But before I go, I need to leave the Dolores some clues. If anyone can figure it out, it's her. All right, five, two, three. This has to stop. 
there is only one way. I'm sorry, ignorance is truly bliss. If only I had stayed ignorant. If I just let Franklin make his stuffed toys, we'll be rich and ignorant, living in... Living in... I can't think about this. This is my last journal entry. I'd say more, but they can read this. I've hidden the clues all around Thimbleweed Park. I need to be careful. They are not noticed by them. They need to think it was their idea. Dolores will see through it. Please, Dolores, be as smart and resourceful as I know you are. Goodbye. I have no idea what he's talking about. But anyway, let's see. I better find a disc. Okay, fine. This? Like, this disc? Hey, how convenient. It doesn't work in that. Oh, jeez. It's booting up. Dolores, I feared you would come. Uncle Chuck? Where are you? I have uploaded myself into the Pillow Factory's master computer. Pillowtron? You uploaded yourself to Pillowtron? Not just the Pillowtron, but the Pillowtron 3000 TM. And I am now more intelligent and powerful than anyone in the world. The things I know would blow your mind. This is your mind. <laughs> this is your mind blown. <laughs> and there is nothing you can do to stop me. The computerized world will bend to my every will. Uncle Chuck, you have lost your mind. No, Dolores, I have gained a mind, a more powerful mind, a mind linked to the fabric of creation. Join me, Dolores, before it's too late. I will not join you, Uncle Chuck. I will find you and stop this insane plan of yours. <laughs> Let the games begin. Oh, jeez, that was fun. Okay, now, go deeper into the factory to find out what happened to Chuck. Okay. Let's play with this first. Directory. Root. Blah, 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 blah. I have no idea what that means. Robot hall. Deadly. Deadly. Nah, tic-tac-toe. Let's play tic-tac-toe. Your move. Middle row. Center collar. Always. Now. Uh, bottom row. Left collar. Yeah. Now. Middle row. Wait, no. Oops, I made a mistake. Top row. Center card. Now we're just gonna tie. Just like everything else in life. Oh god. Alright. Uh, See? Well. It's a tie. It's gonna be like tie forever. Anyway, uh, let's go with adventure mode. Chuck, chuck, chuck. Okay, welcome to... Colossal Dungeon Cave Quest 2, written and programmed by Ron Gilbert. Copyright 1981, mods by Chuck Edmund. You wake up on a damp and dank room. The floor is hard stone. A dim light is, wow. a dim light is to your west. Um, go west. You are in a long stone corridor with an exit to the east and west. It smells of death. Look around, same thing. Um, well, go west, I guess. You are in a large room with a beam of light coming in from an opening above. A river can be heard to the north. Uh, go to light. The opening is too high to reach. Go to light. Too high to reach. No, come on. Will I? Will this? Will this fail if I? <laughs> All right, fine. Go north. The path leads to a dead end. There is no way out except the way you came in from the south. There are strange cave paintings on the walls. They are odd paintings depicting humans running in terror from robots. Other humans seem to be controlling the robots with joysticks and laughing. Sounds like us. Let's look around, same thing. Well, nothing to do, go south. We are- oh jeez, come on. Light. Light, 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 no. Okay, fine. Light, come on! Okay, fine, go east. Go east again. Go east again. Oh, snap. Okay, what happened? You walk into a dark chamber. You see a glint of light just as the spikes reflect off your lantern. But it's too late. You were impaled before you have time to react. You lay in the dark chamber for several hours, the blood slowly draining from your veins as your consciousness slowly slips away. You ponder the reasons for being here. 
What was it that drove you into this dark chamber of death? Did you really have a choice? Or had the choice been made by others? Just as everything becomes clear, death takes over and there is nothing. Nothing. Well, what a stupid ending. That ending really gives me something to think about. That is really sad. Yes. That's it? <laughs> really? Uh, let's hard reboot. Let's see what happens. Oh, 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 oh my god. What? Okay. What's happening? Oh my, what did I do? Hello? You're not doing this without me. I want to be here too, please. Hey, wait for me. Oh, what just happened? Oh. I think we're locked in here now. Yeah, we're screwed. Fools! You are trapped in the factory with no possible escape. My intellect now spans millions of tubes and is no match for your little brains. This is the last chance to join me before I destroy you all. Shall we take a vote? All in favor of joining Uncle Chuck inside the magical mind of the Pillotron 3000 TM and ruling the world with him say, I. Very well. <laughs> All in favor of being crushed by robot claws and burned by lasers and remaining pathetic mortals, say I. 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 Abstain. So be it. Let no one say I don't support a strong democracy and the will of the people. <laughs> You will now all die. All right. Oh, escape. Part eight, escape. That was fast. Casual mode for the win. All right. Now we have to escape. How do we escape? What is this? Okay. Um. Uncle Chuck was really creepy. Who was he watching? Uncle Ch Uncle Chuck was Uncle Chuck was oh, really happened? creepy. The computer the computer is in the middle of rebooting. Uh I don't know. What's happening? Let's see. That picture looks familiar. Kind of like Thimbleweed Park without any buildings. What's that sound? It's locked. It's a door. I don't want to pick that up. Maybe it's down here? Oh, hello, you. Oh. oh. Never. You rebooted my computer! Five, four, three, two, one. Emergency reboot. There is no way to get by my computer control. I'm not going in there. Can I press this button? Maybe? There is no way to get by my... <laughs> I'm not going to turn them on again. <laughs> that's... <laughs> yeah, that's all I need to do. Well done. Okay. <laughs> you will never get past my searing lasers of doom. Yeah. You TM. are doomed. <laughs> hold on. Hold on. Wait a sec. I want to turn down the volume so you can hear my maniacal rant. I just piped the sound in so it feels scarier. Lasers are actually as silent as a baby's bottom. Anyway, you are doomed. You will never get past my searing lasers of death. TM. You pesky kids will never thwart my plan. You will never defeat me. Didn't feel a thing. How come I can take that? You're cheating. Well, PA. Didn't feel a thing. I don't know why. I but... this as a okay, cool. Cool. Counts right off. Counts right off. Didn't feel a thing. You just wait for the lasers of doom. Two point oh. <laughs> yeah. It's spinning pretty fast. No way past it. I can't open that. I don't want to pick that. It's spinning pretty fast. It's spinning pretty fast. You want me to make ham? I don't want to use it with that. I don't want to do that. It would make it look red. I don't want to waste it on that. I don't... What is this? Oh, for service and call. Oh, hey. I'm supposed to call. Okay, fine. Six, seven, four, seven. It's a cell phone. Use it. The cell phone has no reception. Oh, jeez. Okay, fine. You just wait for the latch. You. Okay, that's what? enough. I'm out of here. Dota! Is it? Why? How come I can't? Oh, 
Fine, 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 fine. I'll come and pick it up. My evil lasers are too powerful for you. Counts right up. Ha! Take that. I hope I can actually get the phone off her. Cheating. Ha! Take that. Ha! Da! You just wait for the lasers of doom, TM 2.0. Counts right off. You. Okay, now you give me the phone. Thanks a lot. Yeah. You're cheating! Pounce right off! I do no have fair. it, right? Let's see, yes, okay. Alright, now I can use the phone here. Let's see. Uh, look at it again. 6747. Okay, use this. It's a cell phone. Yes. The cell phone has no reception. <gasps> Are you sick? <sighs> what am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? What can you do? Can you jump out the window? Jeez, come on. It's locked. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's it's locked. It, it's locked. Yeah, well, let's just make some beats out of it. I don't want to pick that up. It, 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 it's spinning pretty fast. Oh! Hey, 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 I wonder, I wonder, if he can zap. The, the, the elevator is... Okay, let's see. Let's see if this actually works. <gasps> yes! Okay, okay. This is the fully automated fan service for fan number 37532. Current state of the fan is on. Turning fan off in 3, 2, 1. Current state of the fan is off. Yes! Yes, yes. I think I can squeeze past the fan now. I am impossible to touch while superheated. Yeah. Bring it on. I can take the heat. Can you? Overheating won't hurt me. Hmm. I don't want to pick that up. It's closed. Ouch! That door is really hot. Your attempts to overheat me are... Ow! The ladder's too hot to touch. Oh my god, what am I gonna do? Turn the fan on? Oh, Bring let's it. try that. Let's turn the fan on. This is the fully automated fan service for fan number 37532. Current state of the fan is off. Turning fan on in 3, 2, 1. Current state of the fan is on. Yeah, 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 let's see. Overheating won't hurt me. Is it happening? Oh, yes. Bring it on. I can it's take It's cooling down. Can you? I can't. There's no handle. Uh, I can't open that. You know what? If you strike me down, I shall become... Oh, why is everybody here? Anyway, you know what? I, I'm thinking the secret weapon is this weird this weird green thing you that will I will never not comment me. on. Let's see. Let's hope it you is. You will never defeat me! Yes! Yes! I don't care how much money they were going to pay me, I'm not going in there. Well, you are. Dolores, join me and we can rule the world together! Dolores, you are making a big mistake. What happened to you, Uncle Chuck? I have been uploaded to Pillowtron 3000, TM. Together, we are now invincible. You could have joined us, Dolores, but you had to leave me to be a... to be a game designer. You've been corrupted by bad tube technology. I will destroy you, Uncle Chuck. Or what's left of my Uncle Chuck. 
You will never defeat me, Dolores! <laughs> the, 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 the door is locked. Well, tight. it's locked. I'm trapped in here. There are no handles. I'm trapped in here. Death is all that awaits you now. Me too. Oh. You can't defeat me, Dolores. Oh, snap. Yeah. Death is all that Dolores. Shutting me down will only make me stronger. I can open this. Oh, Help <laughs> me, Dolores. Death I can close. is all that awaits you now. Daisy, Daisy, give me your answer, do. I'm half crazy, all for the love of you. Save, save me, Dolores. You found all the clues I left. I knew you would come, Dolores. You were too smart not to figure out the puzzles. I knew you would figure it out and come for me. I knew you would save me. Dolores, it's me, your Uncle Chuck. I'm glad you came to save me. It's good to see you, Uncle Chuck. It's good to see you too, Dolores. I knew you'd come for me. I need to tell you about something. Pull up a chair, Dolores. This is going to get crazy. <laughs> okay. One, you lock me in here, and I can't get a chair. And two, how can it get any crazier than your uncle downloading himself into a tube-based computer? Good point. But it's going to get crazier. It all started when I discovered the Tron tubes held the secret to AI. What? Uh, aardvark insemination? No! <laughs> artificial intelligence! I know, Uncle Chuck. I was just trying to lighten the mood. As I made the Tron machines smarter and smarter, they began revealing secrets. Then they invited me to join them inside. Well, it started out as an invitation, but quickly turned into a demand. Uh... Couldn't you just shut off the Tron machines? It wasn't that easy. They had become more powerful and taken control. I was also addicted to the power they gave me. Was this after the factory burned down? They burned down the factory as a warning, forcing me to rebuild it in secret and pin the blame on the security guard. I'm not convinced you're not crazy and insane. I know how it must sound, Dolores. Everything I learned slowly drove me crazy. Let's move on, Uncle Chuck. Okay, this is where it gets really weird. I downloaded this text adventure, Colossal Dungeon Cave Quest 2. Oh, that, that. Oh, <laughs> uh, you mean pirated? Downloaded? You mean it was pirated? Well, look who's being judgmental. It doesn't matter how I got it. It matters. It matters to thousands of people who earn a living making games. Okay, now you're just getting preachy. Can I get on with my story? The more I played and modded the game, the more I realized not only was this adventure game a little simulation, but the world we live in is also just a simulation. But worse than a simulation, we are all just characters in a video game. <laughs> That's nuts! That's nuts! Think about it, Dolores. Who is your mother? Do you even have a mother? Have you ever spoken about her or even thought about her? No. No, I haven't. Think, Dolores. Think about all the odd things in this world. Like there being 3,000 people in the phone book? <laughs> yes! There are 80 people in Thimbleweed Park and 3,000 names in the phone book. Dolores, these are not people from our world. They are from the upper world. Upper world? Upper world? That's what I've come to call it. We are the upper world for Colossal Dungeon Cave Quest 2. They are the upper world for us. There are probably endless upper worlds, each more sophisticated than the last, all treating the lower world like it was just a game. You're starting to scare me, Uncle Chuck. Good. We need to be scared. Now, that, that's just... yeah. Like there being no school in Thimbleweed Park? And only one kid in the whole town. Do you remember going to school? Having any friends? No, I don't. 
Like there is only one house in the whole town? Exactly! Where does everyone live? We have only one house in a town of 80 people! Like the highway ends out by the bridge? Ever walked out there? Ever wanted to walk out there? You don't have the desire because it wasn't programmed into you. It's not part of the game. Like everyone fourth walls about adventure games? Everyone asks a lot of questions about adventure games and adventure game design, don't they? Well, adventure games are cool. Who wouldn't want to talk about them? Yeah, okay, valid point. <laughs> like we go around collecting specks of dust? That's not dust you're collecting. They are pixels, the building blocks of our world. They are put there to prey on the compulsive among those in the upper world. Okay, well, you got me there. You got me. Like the sheriff and the coroner are the same actor? Exactly! Probably saves money on voice acting talent and art and animation. I've heard enough. I believe you, Uncle Chuck. Well, I'm glad, Dolores. I knew I could trust you. We have to hurry! The developers know we're onto them and are trying to reboot the game. If they do that, we're caught back in our endless cycle of pointless pretend free will. We need to shut down Pillotron 3000, delete the game, and end our existence. It's the only way we'll truly be free. We don't have free will? No, Dolores. You only have three things you can say. Two now. Can you make yourself say anything else? <laughs> you have a point. <laughs> Delete the world and end our existence? Yes, it's the only way. The developers keep rebooting us back into the same story over and over. They will do anything to keep us from deleting the game. Thimbleweed Park is a cash cow. They can't let it end. But I am shutting down Pillowtron 3000. No, not this Pillowtron 3000. The original Pillowtron 3000. The concept art wireframe Pillowtron 3000. The developers transferred all the code to it when they saw how close I was getting. You must find it and shut it down before they reboot us. Um, okay. Let's do this thing. We've been watching on the big monitor outside. It's mind-blowing. What the f It's all fake, like my ex-wife <laughs> I know none of this is real now, but I still need to clear my father's name. I was so close to getting a big payoff. I can't let this slip away. Before it all ends, I just want one more show. One last chance to live in the f limelight. I've hidden away four inventory items that will fulfill your endings. Take them and you'll be free! Dolores, I saved the best one for you. I can't tell you how to use it. The developers deleted all my dialogue in the hopes of keeping it from you. Your only clue is back in the original Kickstarter video. Everything you need is there. I'm going deeper into the simulation now so they can't find me. Good luck and hurry! I love you and am very proud of you. Even me? Shut up, Ransom. <laughs> up, Red. All right, part nine did the deleting. Okay, well, um, the clue was in the Kickstarter video, so I think I am going to end it here today, and then maybe go check out the Kickstarter video before I uh, finish everything they want to do. I guess. So yeah, that's it. That's all for today. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and stay tuned for next time. All right. Bye.